you know, I'm gonna let you daydream, my G. It's here. Finally. Your first day of culinary school. So many dishes to prepare. So many students to meet, bro. This is feeling, this is feeling like food wars, man. Already. Let's go, bro. Hey fam. <laughs> Is it recording me do this? <laughs> okay. Uh hey, what's up? What's good? What's good? Hey fam, what you know good? Day in Sims, look, I'm the colonel now. I tried to move myself over there. I couldn't. Hey, fam. <laughs> so, uh, we got some new shit. We got some new shit, you feel me? Some new, uh, editing shit. I wanted to, you know, uh, not editing shit. <laughs> some new software, I just wanted to mess with it. Because I, I have not been able to give y'all a game like this, so... Y'all gonna get a game like this. Alright. We're going to new game. I just wanted to see how it is. I'm not gonna play it for a while. Uh, come, hey. I'm like, where are you at? Why does it have to be all caps? Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. Don't know how long I'm gonna play this. Probably like 10 minutes. <laughs> Not long. Just want to see it. Check it out. Uh, if y'all, if I, I mean, if I get a decent review on it, maybe. But I don't expect y'all to really care about this game. You sleep softly as the morning sun casts a warm glow through the window of your modest student apartment. The world is peaceful and serene. You could stay in the moment forever. Right. Stop! What is that? Or stop! <laughs> Or you could wake up now, now, now. Your first day of culinary school is no time to sleep in. Yeah, smack that damn clock. Okay. Lying in bed, you start you ah, <laughs> messing up party. You stare at the ceiling, thinking about everything that awaits you at the prestigious University of Cooking School. That that doesn't sound that prestigious. <laughs> You can't just throw it. Can't just throw that in there. Like, oh yeah, it's prestigious as fuck. Like, no, it's not. Who will be there? What will you cook? What should you wear? Time begins to fly by, and you find your imagination getting away from you. You know, I'm gonna let you daydream, my G. It's here, finally. Your first day of culinary school. So many dishes to prepare. So many students to meet, bro. This feel. This feel like food wars, man. Already, let's go, bro. Your mind is swimming with possibilities when you re when you realize you're running late and you grab a biscuit and burst out the door. Mmm, delicious. Just what you needed to wake up those taste buds. I don't know, bro. That looked the dry. <laughs> Yikes. You're in such a hurry, in fact, that you forget to put on any deodorant before running out of the door. You're sweating buckets as you rush to arrive on time. Uh-oh. Ah, why you gotta do that? So they saying if I was like, let's go, I would have been clean. Alright. I feel you, bro. I feel you, damn it. Okay. Yeah, make me musty. My first day. You're gonna love that. Standing in the quad, you gaze upon the magnificent university of cooking. Here comes your lifelong best friend forever. Miriam. She's the most adorably awkward person you've met ever met. And you absolutely love her for it. <coughs> Good morning, useless. Are you excited for the first day of... Wait. <laughs> for the first day of the rest of our lives? Actually, um... Because I'm... Sh because I sure am. Excited to... A sing <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I'm, I'm too excited to do the damn voice. Because I sure am. Excited. A little nervous. Okay, okay. A lot nervous. What's the... It's just that. This morning I made breakfast for myself, but... Well... When I ate it, I couldn't taste any love... Any love in the food. <laughs> what if I'm no good? What if I fail? Classic Mir Miriam. Raised by, ma by master chef parents. She 
she's always held herself to a very high standard. Ever since we were little babies playing together and you rescued me from that quicksand box, it's been clear to me that you're the most loving, caring person I know. You're gonna do great. <laughs> but, but, but what about what? English motherfucker, do you speak it? But what the University of Picking School Academy of Learning's famous three-day only semesters, I'm afraid of being left behind and never catching up. A sweet girl like Miriam has always had a flair for the dramatic, you feel me? This summer, she got so nervous about her first kiss that she chipped the tooth practicing on a mannequin. What? Pep talk, your best friend. Change the subject. Pep talk. Remember last month when we saw that uh, fortune teller and, and, uh, and, and, and had a tarot card read? Or our tarot cards read? The lady with the mask who gave me nightmares? I've been trying to forget. I know, she looks spooky. But she was so sweet. And she told us that you were destined, I mean, but and she told you that you was destined to do great things, you feel me? Remember, that car with the fancy looking tower? And that other car featuring the handsome fellow in the red suit? I've been waiting so long to meet the handsome fellow I could call my own. And I'm sure you will soon. In no time. We'll be graduating out there, babe, and you'll be delighting the world with your heartfelt cooking. I'm on go! On four now! <laughs> As you talk to Miriam, you <laughs> can feel you can feel her nerves begin to ease. You know what? Maybe everything will be okay after all. And if not, at least I have these killer bangs. Not that I know. Not that I know. <laughs> Can you believe I cut them myself? I mean, hey, they ain't, they ain't bad. You can definitely believe it. Oh, oh, he talking shit. Uh, I, uh, I cannot believe it. Before you can get another word out, you rudely interrupt it when someone smacks your books and custom engraved measuring spoons out of your hands and onto the ground. Hey! It's... How the hell do you say that, Ashley? I get hard when she walk past me. I'ma just call you Ashley. It's Ashley, your arch rival. She's totally evil, but you can't help but be filled with jealousy. She can get anything she wants, and she knows it. Hello, Ashley. I didn't, I didn't mean to say it like that. He said, hello, Ashley. Oh, excuse me. Stop it! Stomach up. Oh. Let me give her a voice. <clears throat> oh, I didn't see you there, chicken chins. Oh, where? See? <clears throat> my, my voice getting fucked up. You leave useless shins alone. They're perfectly normal shins. Ugh, I can't. You can't stand Ashley. Even her name is annoying. You know for a fact. Ha! <laughs> that is actually Ashley. But she had to add extra letters to make herself feel better. Facts. 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 Oh my gosh. I'm, I'm glad that they clarified that for me and let me know that I was, I was saying it right. If, if anyone here knows what perfect shins look like, it's us. Oh, uh, she said, yeah, put, join me in the club. Man. We're not going to let you or your really weird insults get to us, yeah, cause that was mad weird, bro. Shins? Ain't, ain't, never, ain't nobody ever came for my shins in their life. And if they did, I don't I don't know what my rebuttal would be. I don't... Across the quad, you see Ashley's best friend. Von Von or Van Van and Man... Van Van the Man Man has stopped to look at his own reflection in the mirror. His pants are so tight you can see him casually working out his glutes while he styles his hair. No lie, they're rocking glutes. Okay. <laughs> bang, bang. I might make her sound goofy. You rang, rang. You've never been sure what their <laughs> arrangement is. <laughs> but as long as you Knowing them, Ashley and Van Van have been just as close as you and 
Miriam, but substantially more devious. I can't believe that uni that University of Cooking School Academy for Learning. Why do they keep saying the whole thing? Whatever. <laughs> Will ever allow people like you to attend as students? I know, right? <laughs> you you think that you think they just say they just hand a, dipl a diploma or something, right? <laughs> we don't even fucking need a beer. Or maybe hire us on as professionals. You amateurs could learn a, a lot from us. With the first day of school about to start, there is just not time to properly tell these two off. So you just you just leave. Let's go, Miriam. Let's dip. See you later, losers. As you approach the door, you see a goofy-looking kid pushing hard against the window directly next to, you, to it. Pop. Uh. I think I bro I mean, I think it's broken. You reach forward and easily pull the open the door. Uh, that should do the trick. I love you. I think you mean thank you. <laughs> my name is Pop. I was named after my Pop Pop. He's old. What? What? Say what again? I dare you. Can someone like this also be a student at the school? He's. He must be one heck of a chef. Also, his name tag clearly says Bob, but I guess he's reading it upside down? Hi, Pop. I'm useless. So... Are you going to make me hold it- hold this door all day? Oh, no, that was me. <laughs> nope. Nope! And with that, the young man walks into the building ahead of you. Is it just me, or is he kind of cute? I think it's just you. <laughs> Facts. You both <laughs> shrug your shoulders before following him into the building. You stand at the edge of the room, unsure where to sit. Other students wander in and keep themselves busy. Chit chatting. A scruffy looking pooch takes his place at the podium at the front class. Adorable. Now, now, quiet down, everyone. A man named Sprinkles. Who is this? Who is this unreasonably cute pup? And why is he in our culinary class? You must be Spr Sprinkles. Or, oh, that's Miriam. You must be Sprinkles, head instructor and CEO of UCSLAL. Okay, yeah, we, yes, please. Thank you for abbreviating it. Please. <coughs> ah, fuck. I gotta do a voice for this nigga too. Please, call me Professor Dog. I may be cute and a little fluffy, but I still demand respect. Woof. What? A cute dog is our professor? This is the best school ever! I guess, I guess only, dog, only a dog's nose is capable of picking up all the nu nuances of fine dining. I don't, I don't think. So, I wouldn't go to KFC if they had dogs sniffing my food. <laughs> Out of nowhere, wind begins to rush around you as a swirl of cherry blossoms, cherry blossom petals fill the air inside the classroom. I'm, I'm chilly. Someone close the window. And then, he walk in this bed. They do got they do got the colonel looking like on the, like like bro. <laughs> like bro, they got the colonel looking like a looking like a looking like a looking like a, a aged Kakashi. Okay, what? You're immediately swept up in the aura of this new student and his remarkable goatee, who knew on anyone could be so handsome. Time out, right? It's him! It's... If it's... I mean, ooh. If it isn't my favorite student. Harley. Colonel Sanders interrupts Sprinkles. Sorry, Professor Dog. Before he can finish his sentence. Please, call me Colonel. 
Colonel Sanders. Hushed murmured murmur rose through the classroom as Colonel Sanders walks down the aisle of desks. Suddenly, the room is sweltering. Aye. Aye. <laughs> Take these off. Alright, I don't know if my glasses was, was straight that whole time, but <laughs> let me, let me, uh, let me save this, bro. Uh, it's not, man. How do you save it? That'll be it for, uh, I love you, Colonel Sanders. <laughs> Which I don't. I don't. I don't love Colonel Sanders. He makes okay chicken. I miss, nah, I ain't even gonna fake you. I miss some KFC. I ain't had KFC in a while. I, I used to get their famous bowls. They was hitting. But, <laughs> I do gotta dip. I gotta go. Uh, please let me know if y'all appreciate these kind of, like, no edited real fast-paced uh, reading videos. Like I said, it's probably not going to be edited too much because it's all one video. It was real convenient because I haven't really been able to record things like this for you guys. But with the new software for the webcam, I was able to like record all of this in one video. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you do, please leave a like. Comment down below if y'all want to see me, uh, I don't know, try and get with Colonel Sanders. I think I was a girl that whole time. But yeah, comment below if y'all want to see me get with Colonel Sanders. I'm probably not going to pick him if there's an option to pick anybody else. But hey, you know, he, he rocking that goatee. I can't pick. <laughs> Alright, y'all. I'm, I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Love each and every one of y'all. Make sure y'all subscribe and stay good. Because I'm going to talk to y'all later. I don't. I, I ain't hit that note. I'm mad I didn't. We're just going to end it. So, all right. Bye. <laughs>